Hi guys, it's Multitechno101 here again, and today I will be doing the installation of the iCarbon's black carbon fiber skin only for the back of my MacBook Pro 13 inch. So, as you can see, here's my MacBook, and I will now remove the spec see through satin case. So, as you can see, here is my MacBook Pro with the spec see through satin removed only for the top part. So, iCarbons recommends you to wipe your MacBook clean before you install the iCarbons to um, to ensure that the adhesive on um, the iCarbon skin will stick properly on your MacBook Pro. So let's just scrub it a bit. I'm now using the Apple microfiber cloth. So let's go ahead and take this out. So, here it is, the iCarbon skin. It's a bit wrinkled because um, Postman kind of threw it around a bit. And here is the white carbon fiber cutout for the Apple logo, which I might not be using, depending on what it looks like. So first, let's tear this off the 3M adhesive sheet and put that one side. Okay, so what you want to do is start from the um, Apple logo and work your way through. It might take you time, but since this is made out of a silicone adhesive, you can um, peel it up anytime and go again. So, just going to, apply, to install this now. It is very, very sticky, so... Yep. So... It takes some force to peel it off. So here I have the iCarbons already installed, and you might want to use the 3M sheet to help you with your insulation as iCarbons recommended. Um, this, before you apply this on your MacBook, you might see that it wrinkles a bit. Well, quite easily actually, it wrinkles quite easily, but once you apply it, um, the wrinkles all go away because it's stuck to your MacBook Pro. So as you can see here, the corners fit perfectly. Um, the, it isn't that perfectly aligned. There is going to be a border of where your MacBook Pro will be exposed, but I don't think that's big of a deal. And Okay, anyways, the corners will fit perfectly if you push them down hard enough. In the case that it doesn't stick, you might want to use a hair dryer or um, a heat gun to kind of mold it back down on your MacBook Pro. So this might take you a few times to align the Apple logo correctly. But it, overall, it's pretty easy to install. This product sells for 19 um, wait, hold on, let me check. So this product sells for $19.96 on um, www.icarbons.com. If you live in America, it's going to be free shipping, so you might want to check that out. And it ships from Florida, so for those of you who live in the States, it's going to ship pretty quickly. So this is the iCarbons installation for the MacBook Pro and stay tuned for my review. Thank you, and this is Multitechno 101 signing out.